SMEs are like a seedling. It requires good environment and a lot of nurturing. You need to take care of the seedlings well so that the root will grow deep and then the tree will grow high. SMEs constitute more than 98% of the total number of firms. But over the last few years, what the government has found is they don't contribute as proportionate to their size to the economy. The government came up with the SME Master Plan with a view to change the landscape and make sure that you have high value, high growth SMEs in Malaysia. Although we, SMEs now contributing at 37.3% of the GDP, but we see that in, we want to achieve or to be a developed or high-income nations, we need to bring up SME's contribution in the GDP. The SME master plan is like a manual and it can guide us uh, to greater heights. If it's implemented properly and well, I believe there will be a lot of SMEs getting the benefit of it. We have this platform supporting us. Give us a lot of advices and guidance on how we can commercialize our products, our innovation. With that financial support, we are able to do the validation and testing of our innovation to convince the market. And now we are moving to global market after three years of commercialization. We have a very far halal app where we put all, for example, jacking 8,000 companies that halal into the system. Today we have about close to 94,000 downloads seen in 137 countries. So that is the major milestone with the platform fund that create us to create more very for halal and make it an app and make it even better and better. The key ingredients in that master plan is the ability to gather and create a platform where all the government machineries or agencies collaborating together to achieve the same goals. So through that platform, we have programs that we collaborating with other agencies, other ministries, or even we give funding for them to, to execute the plan. Going forward, one would definitely hope that there are a lot more of these high growth SMEs thriving in an ecosystem which is enabled by public policy to be able to provide better and high value added jobs for the Malaysian economy.